Hey guys, welcome back to the channel, and I'm here for overrated metal bands, and now I'm not going to include every band on here that I think is overrated because this video would be too long, and plus I already have 10 bands to pick out in this video, so other than that, let's go ahead and get started with this shit. Okay, so the first band I'm going to talk about is Avenged Sevenfold. So, Avenged Sevenfold definitely had to make the, let this video because I think they're very overrated despite me being a fan of them. I still admit as a fan of them that they're overrated as fuck. Everyone that says they're Avenged Sevenfold fan would probably say that Event Sevenfold is probably one of their favorite bands, which I would probably used to say that, but I've kind of outgrew this band a little bit because I would just listen to this band too much and it burned me out. So I used to like their music a lot. I still do like their music. I've just really kind of outgrew them a little bit, but they're still a great band, but I do admit that they are overrated as fuck to be completely honest but they're still a great band despite them being overrated okay so the next band on here is going to be disturbed now i'm definitely a big fan of disturbed they were one of the first metal bands that i ever heard even before becoming a full-time fan of metal music in general i was around 12 or 13 years old when I first heard Disturbed's music for the first time, so yeah, that's way before I came a metalhead full-time. I didn't become a metalhead full-time until I was like probably 18 or 19 years old, so yeah, but yeah, Disturbed, they were one of my first metal bands, and I'm actually glad because I really like a lot of their songs, but again, I am at that Disturbed is an overrated band but they're still a great band for sure so yeah disturbed had to make the list but they're still a great band and will always be one of my favorite bands of all time great band for sure at least in my opinion they are okay so the next band on this list is five finger death punch now i probably said this a few times before for Five Finger Death Punch, but I used to be a big fan of this band, but I outgrew this band completely. I don't really listen to them anymore. Now, I don't hate Five Finger Death Punch as much as other people does, but I'm just not really into them anymore. Their music just all sounds alike, and I got sick and tired of hearing a band that fucking sings about the same old shit all the time. That's the problem I have with Five Finger Death Punch now. I don't hate them, but that's one of the main reasons why I outgrew them because all of their songs, majority of them sound like, even though I do like pretty much all of their albums, I admit that, you know, they're overrated as hell and they're just a band that I just can't really get into no more. So, sorry to the fucking big Five Finger Death Punch fans. This band has outgrown me, and for good reason, too, because their music has just become, I don't know how to say it, but it's just become just too ridiculous for me to handle anymore. So... Yeah, Five Finger Death Punch, I don't hate them, like I said, but I just outgrew them, and that's one of the, another reasons why I haven't bought their new album, F8, it on CD. So, yeah, Inside Out is a great song, though. I will always like that song from Five Finger Death Punch, but other than that, though, I just really outgrew them, even though I still probably would listen to them a little bit, even though I wouldn't listen to them as much as I used to like a year or two ago. So, yeah, I don't really listen to them as much as I did a couple years or so ago, or even a year ago. So yeah, with that being said, Five Finger Death Punch is definitely overrated and they had to make 
this video for sure because out of all of the modern metal bands they're one of the most overrated ones for sure so yeah let's go and move on to the next band now the next band is god smack now i know a lot of people right now are thinking you're putting god smack on an overrated metal band list yes because the same thing goes with them they're basically a similar style to Five Finger Death Punch, but I think they're a better band than Five Finger Death Punch. Because Godsmack, at least their albums and songs don't have as much filler on them and all that. So yeah, I really like Godsmack better than Five Finger Death Punch, even though Five Finger Death Punch and Godsmack basically do the same style of heavy metal where the people want to argue that it's hard rock or heavy metal. Either way, I would say Godsmack is a metal band. So, yeah, but yeah, out of the styles that both of those bands do, I prefer Godsmack any day because I think they're the better band. So, with that being said though, Godsmack is an overrated band, but they're still a great band for sure, and I can't wait to see what they do next when they release another album, if they release another album. So, with that being said, Let's go ahead and move on to the next band. Now, the next band is a metalcore band. I know you guys already know about this band because I've talked about them a couple of times or so before on the channel. And the band is Kill Switch Engage. Now, Kill Switch Engage is one of the best metalcore bands out there and one of my favorite metalcore bands of all time. But I do have to say that they are overrated because when a lot of people are asked what is their favorite metalcore band or one of their favorite metalcore bands they would probably say kill switch engage so yeah there's your answer there but they're still a great band now some albums i think are better than others but kill switch engage is still a very good band and they're popular for a reason because i don't care what vocalists are talking about howard jones or jesse leach kill switch engage is still a great band either way at least in my opinion. So, yeah, they are an overrated band though, but they're not bad though. They're still a great band though, despite them being overrated. So yeah, Kill Switching Age is still one of my favorite metalcore bands, despite them being overrated. And if they ever release another album, I can't wait to hear it because they are one of my favorite metalcore bands ever. So, the next band on the list is going to have to be Lamb of God now. I was considering of not including them on this video or in this video, but I decided to because they're one of the most overrated bands of the 90s and the 2000s, but they're still a good band. I, I like a handful of their songs. I don't have many of their albums on CD, probably like three albums of them on CD so far, but I still do like Lamb of God. But I haven't really enjoyed everything I heard from them. But I still do like them. I tried to check out some songs from their 2009 album. I just couldn't really get into any of those songs hardly. But their other stuff I've heard from them so far has been really, really good. And I think Randy Bly is a great vocalist. So, yeah, but that being said, Lamb of God is still an overrated band. But they're still really good, though, to me, they are. I know Lame of God isn't meant for everyone to be a fan of, but I am a fan of them. So, yeah, they are overrated for sure. So they have this video since they're overrated. Okay, the next band is going to have to be Pantera. Because Pantera is overrated. Wait, hold on. Pantera is making the list. Let me restart over here with this. Okay, so Metallica is after Lamb of God, not Pantera. Pantera will be after Metallica. So let's talk about Metallica first. My bad there. Okay, so Metallica. Now, Metallica is one of the big four bands of thrash metal here in the United States because there is a Teutonic big four for German thrash metal bands. Just want to point that out there. So, yeah, Metallica, they're one of the most popular bands of all time, if not the most popular band of all time. But that doesn't mean they're the greatest band on earth, you know. So, 
I think Metallica is a good band, but I think they're overrated as fuck. They're probably the most under overrated band on this list, even though these other bands on here are overrated. I think Metallica is the most overrated one out of any band in the world. I know they're not the most, I know they're not the only band that's overrated, and I'm not saying that, but they're the most overrated band of all time when it comes to metal, or whatever, you know, so, yeah, they're still a good band, and I just think they get overhyped sometimes, because... A lot of people say that they only like their first four or five albums, and I definitely get where they're coming from, but but I'm probably the same way, even though I did put Death Magnetic, their 2008 album, in my top five when I done my rank up all. I only done that because I was dumb. But yeah, I do admit that I am probably one of those people that says their first five albums are their best. So yeah, Metallica, they're overrated as fuck. So, not a bad band, just gets way too much praise from every fan in the world. I can see that they're influential now when it comes to thrash metal, but them just getting too much praise now does mean that they're overrated as can be. So, Pantera is the next band, so let's go to move on to them. So, yeah, Pantera was another one of my first metal bands when I actually became a full-time metal fan. I remember hearing Walk on Pandora for the first time around 2015. That's when I used to use Pandora Radio. I don't no longer use Pandora because it gets boring easily for me. But yeah, Pantera's Walk was the first song I ever heard from Pantera. And it's a great song. I do admit though they are overrated because out of any of the 90s bands out there, Pantera is the one that usually gets talked about the most, so yeah, they're definitely overrated, but I still do like Pantera. They are one of my favorite bands when it comes to groove metal, so yeah, Pantera definitely had to make this list though, but one thing I want to point out is that their music was very, very good either way, so with that being said, I just want to say rest in peace, Dimebag Daryl and Vinnie Paul, both of you guys are legends and you both are missed for sure. So, let's go ahead and move on to the next band on this list. The next band is going to have to be Slayer. Slayer, again, Slayer is another big four thrash metal band here in the United States. Now, I know Slayer is overrated and also overhated, but they're still an overrated band. I know a lot of people hate on Slayer, but that's for a good reason. Now, I'm a Slayer fan, but to say I'm the biggest Slayer fan ever would be ridiculous. So yeah, I'm not the biggest Slayer fan ever, just because I am into their music. Because I I admit, they do have some albums that are mad. So, yeah, but... I still do like Slayer. I think they're overrated as fuck, and so is their album Rain and Blood. But overall, they're an overrated band for sure. So, Slayer had to make the list because they're one of the most overrated bands ever. For real. Okay, and the last band on here is gonna have to be Slipknot now. Slipknot is a really good band. I think Corey Taylor is a great screamer and singer because you know how Slipknot has their ballads sometimes on their albums. But either way, I think Slipknot is a very talented band for sure. They have a lot of good songs that I can definitely headbang my fucking head to and that's really awesome. But yeah, I do have to say that Slipknot is very overrated though for sure. But they're still a good band and I hope they do release another album because I know they was supposed to release one during the We Are Not Your Kind tour called Look Outside Your Window. I think that was the name of it, but they didn't release it. But hopefully they do eventually. So yeah, with that being said, that's going to wrap it up, guys, for overrated metal bands. Let me know some bands and metal that you think are overrated. This is my list. I know I couldn't include every band that I think is overrated, but it's okay. I feel like I pointed out a lot of great bands here that are overrated so yeah with that being said i'll see y'all next time thank you for watching and yeah, peace